What is going on to you Sagittarius out there? I hope y'all are having a great day. Um, there's a link in the comment section below called the Linktree link. Uh, it will read, click on it. It will redirect you to a website which has all the ways for you to financially support the channel. So I can most definitely uh, keep the show going. Shout out to everybody that has come through. Keep coming through. Um, appreciate you. So let's get into it. So for you Sagittarius, right? You have the Page of Pentacles. <clears throat> the temperance which is Sagittarius right literally the major arcana of Sagittarius so you most definitely showed up in your own reading and then you have the two of wands let me just go ahead and open this window because it's warm in here I'm not even gonna lie it's warm in here yeah it's warm in here for real but anyway for you Sagittarius um the page of pentacles the temperance and the two of wands for a lot of you is really about you, Sagittarius, ultimately. Um, a lot of you, Sagittarius, first and foremost, a lot of you very much so have a lot to bring to the table. That's one thing that I'm seeing. But because, you know, you're represented by the Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles is a person, when their mind and their heart is in the correct place, they can actually bring, bring quite a bit to the table, you know, and not only, it's not just money, you know, a lot of times people think that, you know, people don't, are designed or redesigned to only think about money all the time, cash all the time. And it's like, when we're talking about value over here on this channel, I don't know how it is that other people do it on other channels. I don't, it's, I'm, I'm at a point where I really just, I stay in my own lane, truth be told, you know, um, but value has way more to do with than just cash flow. You know, there's the there's how you make other people's lives easier, being of service to other people without, you know what I mean, without constantly having to put everything aside for the person all the time. You know, and a lot of you Sagittarius can do that. You know, you can most definitely do that when your mind. When your mind and your heart is in the correct place, listen, I'm in New York, okay? We're going, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, we hear this type of nonsense at any time. It is what it is, you know? They're not called on me, but um, the Page of Pentacles represents you Sagittarius can do this when your mind and your heart are in the correct place, like a lot of you are. So a lot of you Sagittarius will definitely bring a lot of value to the table and you know it's just that the temperance the what is the difficult part is getting there is getting someone is getting there is getting someone that is compatible for you right and you know like it is that i said before you sagittarius can be a a required a a required taste you know what i mean but at the same time too as long as y'all minds and hearts are in the correct place, I mean, a lot of y'all are attractive. So like, you know, you're already 50, I ain't gonna say 50%, but you're already kind of already in the door a little bit. And the two of wands represents how a lot of you Sagittarius, oh, yo, all this kind of, all this, my bad, all of this type of uh, hair and all of this, my bad, y'all. But anyway, so the two of wands represents how this is a situation for you where that's pe that's like a little piece of like hair or whatever the case may be. I guess that's dog hair. But anyway, um, the two of wands represents because a lot of people just seem to be combative. You know, it's not a very good mix. And and I've said this before over here on this channel, we have to actually start taking taking accountability. And what I mean by that is. You have to know the difference between when you are someone that's doing something messed up, turning somebody off, right? Switching them off like a light, or when you are essentially, it's not you, it's really other people, okay? And, you know, ultimately at the end of the day, the two of wands is about if it is other people, then you Sagittarius just continue on the path that you already are on ultimately. 
you know, but if it really is other people, the two of wands is about, you can't just allow, you know, yourself to, I would honestly suggest you Sagittarius to not, to really try to see if you can solve the problem yourself, you know, because, you know, this is why it is that I, I talk about, you know, the modern day society and how, you know, stupid, <laughs> you know what I mean? how chupid <laughs> things are it's really because of the fact that it, it is you know you'll you'll go to somebody asking somebody for help asking somebody for advice trying to figure it out trying to do better why is it that you know certain elements of a relationship you just can't get into one and what you Sagittarius will find lo and behold is that people will delude you people will put you, you know, delude you. And what I mean when I say they'll delude you, I mean, they'll tell you the person didn't like you. You know, all the regular stuff that we're accustomed to hearing. The person didn't like you. Um, the person was just using you. You didn't get the hint. All of these, all of this intellectual dishonesty, all of this deflection, you know, all of this deflection from it, look, because at the end of the day, if the person doesn't want to hang out with you, why, for the, for the life of me, why, if, they, if their time is so much more valuable than yours, are they wasting so much time talking to you? If you honestly think that, do you, and I want some of the Sagittarius in the comment section to really kind of understand where it is not coming from, right? and people watching this video, right? And I would like for y'all, let's see how responsive a lot of y'all are. I would like for y'all to answer me this question, right? Answer it me truthfully. Do you think that if, I'm, if I've flown overseas, I'm accomplishing some of the goals that, I'm, that I want to accomplish, right? Learning, you know, learning martial arts in certain places that I touch down, which is one of my goals. Do you honestly think that I'm going to waste my time trying to hang out, try, trying to talk to somebody who, you know what I mean, from the U.S., who's telling me about how X, Y, Z, I'm getting all the things that I want. I'm going to just bounce. Like, unless it, do you think that I'm going to talk to that person, continue to talk to them? Because for me, the only the only time in which that that type of nonsense why I, I I talk about it is because it's a nuisance because this person can't can't just be truthful or whatever the case may be, and I would like for them to stop. But then, how I get them to stop is to cut them off completely. But it's the same kind of scenario for you, Sagittarius. It's like all of the all of these games that's being played, right? And then you know you know that it's not you, and then you go to a, a someone that you think supports you, and that stupid behind deludes you. Oh, it's your fault. You know, it's your fault. There's something that you're doing. Yeah, it's it's because they wanna. Yeah, it's because they wanna mess with me. Is why it is. You know. Oh, they didn't like you, and 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 I gotta I gotta make a video talking about this ideology of talk of of liking somebody because this ideology of liking you you'll have people who will sleep with people that they supposedly like but will completely disrespect but don't last a very long time with but then they'll completely disrespect another person go out of their way to disrespect another person and make them feel dejected but then secretly deep down inside, want to be with these people because they get so bent out of shape when those people move on in life. So who? So what are we really talking about, about who likes who at the end of the day? That whole who likes who thing is, is, is null and void because that's deflection as well. So when, after you get over these people deluding the mess out of you, what happens? Now it's you Sagittarius felt dejected. So this is what I mean when I say it's best for you to try to fix the problem yourself. Talk to them. If you can't get anywhere talking to them or if you already know that they're hard-headed, you can't talk to them, it's time to ghost them. 
Because if you expect these MFers to come right and, and not delude you, these people are crazy. Like intellectual dishonesty is, a, and, and I was talking to my family members about that today. Intellectual dishonesty is a serious problem with society. So many people are indulging in it because so many adults, mind you, these are adults talking about they religious and religious this and they religious, but then they commit fraud by intellectual dishonesty, but they're this religious and all this other type of stuff. Would your prophet, whatever religion they believe in, would their prophet approve of this intellectual dishonesty that they are committing against you? I thought religion was about truth. And having said prophet to hold you accountable in this life and in the, in the next life, right? So this is the stupidity. But then you have the tower and then you, you have the tower and then you have the page of swords, right? So the tower and the page of swords is about how, so, you know, it's, and the thing about it is that it's, it's a, it's an unexpected thing because you Sagittarius expect these people, these friends to have your back. Even the romantic interest, you expect these people to have your back, but come to find out the hard way, right? And it's a it's a very instant thing. It's so sudden when these people show you that they don't have your back. You Sagittarius get caught off guard because you expect them to have your back. These are some of the people that you have a strong connection with. You may even be engaged to. Some of these people may be family and friends, but then you Sagittarius see how much it is that they don't have your back. Snap of a finger. They delude you. You think that you, not even think, you know that you in the right. You know that the way you went about handling your business was correct. It was stand up, it was ethical. But then you'll have so-called family members telling you or friends or maybe even romantic interests throwing it back in your face, telling you you're wrong, trying to deflect, trying to twist, trying to warp this situation. And you're like, how? it's like, you just, they just can't get off of that, can they? They just can't, right? And it's so sudden when they do it because you Sagittarius don't expect these people to do it. So all of these different factors, but here's the crazy part, the Six of Cups. Now the same individuals that you stopped talking to, they're trying to come back. Damn. <laughs> They're trying to come back. <laughs> They're trying to come. I told this to a Sagittarius literally days ago. I, I told the Sagittarius, I ain't going to say the person's name, right? I, I'm not, you know, all due you know, respect to Sagittarius. It's just that me and the Sagittarius don't mix. We just don't, you know what I mean? All due respect to the Sagittarius, right? No hard feelings. You know, but I'm not I'm not going to allow someone to disrespect me and, and, and you know, and, and and get on like they squaring up on me. That will that, that uh, not in my house, it's not in my house, not on, you know, what I'm saying not, you know, but anyway. So. Um, I told the Sagittarius that I told the Sagittarius that I said, I said, if this person tries to come back, if your ex tries to come back, don't let them back. This was days ago before I got this. Before I got this, so I'm telling, so I'm telling the future even without the car. <laughs> Yo, the Six of Cups represents you, Sagittarius, having a past significant other, or if it wasn't that strong, if it didn't get that far, it may have been a romantic interest, or both. Okay, it could be a combination of two. You like this person too, you are actually going out, okay? It doesn't have to necessarily be one or the other. It could be both, right? As a third option. But they're coming back in. Yeah, they're coming back in, Sagittarius. And the hangman represents, you might wanna be very patient because <clears throat> this person is the devil. That, you know, 
the situation specifically between you and this person uh it, it says it says it's the devil mentality it's, it's very dysfunctional to say the least i, I don't want to say the a word you know what i mean but it's it's very it's a very dysfunctional relationship between you and this person sagittarius this person for some odd reason just can't seem to be able to let go and um uh I mean, ultimately, at the end of the day, they can't really control where you go or what you do, you know? Um, now, this is the type of relationship that you Sagittarius are so afraid of or timid of to get into a relationship with, is this specific one. See, you know, Sagittarius is, is represented by the horse or more so specifically the centaur, right? The half person, half horse, but obviously still horse traits, right? So when when you study a horse, right? A horse is a very panicky uh, animal, you know? A horse can, for whatever reason, be very panicky, panic, pull the reins back, you know, rip the reins off. And this is what I mean when I, you know, literally destroy the the reins that go into its mouth the the, the thing that ha you hold on to when you're on the horse literally pull back rip that apart whole leather rip that apart rip the, the rope apart rip it apart like that right so when it comes to a horse because a horse is panicky you have to step back and let that horse do whatever it is that that horse is going to do whether the horse is going to take a step back, run into something, you got to clear right out of there. What You don't get on top of the horse. So it's the same situation for you, Sagittarius, right? This is this type of scenario with this person here, this person who has control issues, this ex, this person who's coming back, who can't for some reason, you know, <laughs> take no for and, and I'm laughing because it's crazy can't take no for an answer or whatever the case may be yeah um don't try to get this person upset you know because sometimes you Sagittarius kind of have a habit of this person disrespecting me this I'm not gonna let this person just disrespect me listen you got to get off of the ego at this current point in time okay it's you know y'all are well beyond talking y'all are well beyond Y'all are y'all are well beyond. You're well beyond having to negotiate. You're well beyond having to talk to this person to get them to stop. You're well beyond this nonsense. Don't. If you ask me, I don't suggest you waste your time trying to bicker and argue and go back and forth. If they come over to your home, do not answer it. You may want to batten down the hatches. And what I mean by that is lock your windows and doors, everybody. Make sure every, all your entrances, including windows, are secured, okay? Uh, uh, if they text you, don't text back. Don't call back. Mm -mm, don't, don't, no, don't do any of that. If you, if you are getting phone calls from an unknown number, don't show a horsey behind self <laughs> call to back let it ring okay let it ring let these people text you and until the sun don't come up anymore let it happen okay don't see because and i have to say this because sometimes because I, I, I sagittarius i hung around more than enough sagittarius y'all have that competitive mentality where oh the person act like that with me oh, okay i'm gonna go ahead and show them listen don't be messing around and get yourself in a stupid situation because y'all Sagittarius want to be hard-headed and think, oh, no, whatever the case may be. Listen to what it is I'm trying to say. You got the devil card. This person is not letting your horsey self go. You got to let go of the ego for a minute and don't you reply back. All right? Now, I can't say I didn't tell you. Anyway, the King of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups represents they whoop de do. Here we go. They want to start up a new relationship again. This is where you keep your your 
everything close to your chest. You do not have to say yes to it at all. The quieter you are, the better it is for you. All right, now, don't say no one told you. So let's clarify the King of Pentacles. The Fool, Temperance, ooh, the World, ooh, Queen of Cups, Four of Wands. The Fool, the Temperance, the Fool, you're going to have to do something that you are not accustomed to, to doing normally, which is let this person win. Let them win. Yeah, but I let them win. Listen, 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 Sagittarius. Let them win. As a matter of fact, that's going to be the title of this video. Let them win. Okay? Let them win the argument. Let them continue to text you if they're going to continue to do that. Put their number on block. Okay? Block their number. Don't you associate yourself with them. Don't go back and forth. Don't give them a response. Because you are responding. You are not interacting. Responding is a different thing. Responding is you are being influenced. Regardless of whether you, you, you believe it or not. Don't matter if you believe it or not. It is what it is. That's what a response is. You are bending to the will of something that is manipulating you. You're bending to its will. An interaction is more scientific than that. You have, you still have control over yourself. The, the temperance is about just that. Temperance is about you want to be very wise with how it is that you go about handling yours. And that wisdom comes from letting them win. Okay? Doing things that, that they, because they are contacting you to it intentionally. If they can't get you to have a conversation, then they'll aggravate you or irritate you to the point where you wig out and you do something stupid so the world and the queen of cups represents you have to look out for yourself by not allowing yourself to engage in that type of stupid behavior by not even saying anything to them at all and then the thing about it is that the four of wands now is about how um because yeah like they they're they're delusional the way that they think and what they want versus the way that you think and what they want. You're, some, you're beyond trying to talk to these people. They're delusional. They're going to do this. They're, they've, they've made up their mind. And this is what it is that they're going to do. So I don't know what to say, Sagittarius. I know, I know Sagittarius be having some problems sometimes. But, you know, I don't know. Good luck.